A new center is open for people battling cancer in Northeast Florida. As News for Jack's reporter Lena Pringle found out how it's helping patients during their treatment. It helps to know that I don't have to worry about a place to live and stay while I'm sick because that takes the concentration mostly on the cancer. Um, but it, this helps take all the anxiety away. Burnett was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer a year ago. Last month, she moved from Fayetteville, North Carolina to the Richard M. Schultz Family Foundation Hope Lodge in the River City. It's absolutely a blessing. It is the greatest place to come to. It is, like I said, I think earlier, it's a dream come true. They provide every aspect, and if you need anything, they provide it, and they make sure that you get it. The Hope Lodge cutting the ribbon on its first ever site in Northeast Florida. This marks the third one in the state with more than 30 other locations across the country. The facility provides a supportive environment with everything cancer patients and their caregivers need as they get treatment free of charge. They get to share the trauma and drama that goes around their treatments, what it really means to them and their families can uh, be with them while they're going through the treatment. So it's win, win, win. And from my vantage point, uh, if you're going through this disease, uh, how much better does it get than when you can you know, share that journey with people uh, very, very much similar to yourself. They can stay at an American Cancer Society Hope Lodge for free for as long as they want to, whether it's a day, a week, a month, a year, you know, we really don't care. I mean, it's just, it's overwhelming. Most patients, when they, when they learn that, they actually start crying. This Hope Lodge has 30 guest rooms and is currently at capacity. Hope Lodges are funded by several people and organizations, giving Hope a home in Northeast Florida. Lena Pringle, Channel 4, The Local Station.